What is going on guys, it's Declan here and today I'm going to be talking about some recently leaked heist information that was leaked by FunMW2 on the GTA forums. He also leaked some information about tournaments that may be coming to GTA 5 online in the near future, so I'm going to be covering all that in this video and for anyone who doesn't know, FunMW2 is basically known for leaking correct information. He did it in the past with content creator tool and he also did it with assassinations, so this information does seem to come from a reliable source, nevertheless it is leaked so it isn't actually confirmed by Rockstar. Anyway guys, if you do go on to enjoy the video, don't forget to drop a like as it really helps out and it really does show you support my videos, and with that said, let's begin. So all the information I'm going to be covering is actually on a forum post that FunMW2 made. I'm going to have a link to that forum post in the description below for you guys to check out, as well as a few screenshots on screen throughout the video. Also guys, the host information I do have isn't actually much information, but it's definitely something to go by and definitely something new. But as you can see on screen right now, I have a screenshot of the actual forum post itself with the code. It says, at the printer, press input context to collect the host details. And then again, it says, press input context to collect the host details. And then underneath that, it says, start hosts. And then as you can see, FunMWT stated, so guys, make sure you have a printer in your apartment for hosts. And they also added a new context called Maze Bank. So as you can see as well, in high-end apartments, there is actually a printer in this room to the left. This is actually rumoured to be the host planning room. I'm not entirely sure if that's true. There you can see there is a map of Los Santos on the wall. And in the corner, there is the printer. And uh, you guys can check this out for yourselves if you really need to. But, you know, are we going to have to start high from our apartments? Who knows? It's definitely, you know, some information to go by. It's leaked information, like I said. So it's definitely not confirmed by Rockstar. But it was leaked by a reliable source, like I said, for anybody who doesn't know, FunMW2 is actually a guy who was covered by a lot of YouTubers, as he is actually known for leaking correct information about content creator and assassinations in the past. He also stated in the forum post that there is going to be a new contact called Maze Bank that may actually be directly related to the Dangerous Business Pack DLC that Rockstar actually released information about, uh, along with the Valentine's Day DLC on the Newswire. And he also stated that it may be directly related to stock markets, as uh, for anyone who doesn't know, it is rumoured that stock markets and betting and a bunch of other good stuff are supposed to be coming in with that dangerous business pack DLC, as well as, you know, buying properties and renting them and all that kind of good stuff. But um, with that said, here is the Maze Bank building, it is the tallest building in the game, and who knows, are we going to have to interact, are we going to have to enter it? Um, who knows? Nevertheless, guys, moving on from that, there was some tournament information I'm going to be covering now. So as you can see from the screenshot on screen right now, here was the tournament info that was pulled from the code. I believe FunMW2 got this from the paste bin full of GTA 5 code information. Nevertheless, it says tournament qualification playlist. You have successfully recorded a total time of A. All players that qualify for the tournament will be contacted by Rockstar once the qualification period is over. You've joined the tournament qualification playlist in progress. Scores from this attempt will not be submitted. Are you sure you want to start this tournament playlist? To me, this is the kind of thing that Rockstar definitely need to add into the game. This actually makes it exciting. Tournaments that we can all face off in to actually, you know, maybe go out to a Rockstar event and have them contact us and win prizes and all that kind of good stuff. Definitely some nice information there if it deems to be true. Definitely something that needs to happen. Um, Rockstar do need to start adding all these kind of crazy things into the game to keep it alive. That's my personal opinion on things. Anyway guys, that is pretty much all the information I have. Like I said, I'll leave all the links to the sources in the description below for you guys to check out. With that said guys, if you did enjoy the video, don't forget to drop a like as it really helps out and it really does show you support my videos. And with that said, I will see you guys in the next video.